Welcome everybody back to another episode of the Preschool and Homestead. It's Wendy here and I'm in the barn about to muck it out, which means clean it for all y'all who do not have a barn um, or work in a barn um, or in a barn, sorry. Uh, yeah, so uh, and I'm about to do that, but I figure just before I do, I just mess around with River a little bit, gave him some hay. And I was thinking about um, just maybe mentioning what our plans are for 2018, or at least a few of them. Um, so, oh, we're just, we're just, I was wondering if you heard something. We actually had some hunters, or maybe some practice shots going off in the neighbor's property. So while we were feed, while I was feeding River, and it made him a little bit uncomfortable. Um, so I'm just kind of watching for that right now and letting you guys watch him as well. He's uh, 21 and uh, lost a little weight at the beginning of the uh, winter due to a bunch of reasons, um, especially including a choking incident, so we're monitoring him very closely and so far so good, he's doing very well. Um, yeah, so back to plans for 2018. Um, right now I am making the book that I don't know if you all know, but I am an author illustrator, and we wrote a book called Life is My School for a Free School and Life is My School about our unschooling life here in Ontario, Canada. And I illustrated the pictures, and I did the, um, the uh, sorry, I wrote the book, and my husband, uh, Jace, he did the editing and the formatting for the book so I didn't have to do any of that techie work which was awesome and so the team together we have made a little publishing company um, called Heart to Heart Art Publishing and through that we published our book both uh, in ebook format and in paperback which you can get in Amazon if you look at the links below it should be easy to find the one I'm talking about so that's our first book which was released in 2017 um, in, in the spring and so this book, the next book that we're doing, working on right now is actually, I am doing another children's book, but I'm actually going to be releasing a journal for um, unschooling or any kind of, uh, you know, homeschooling parents looking for just a little fun way to remind yourself to point form journal each kind of day or, you know, every couple of days. Um, and it's honestly probably the better, better uh, of a record of what you're doing in school, um, or score for schooling, then it really would be in school, kind of remembering the report cards I remember seeing in the past. They're not in any way as uh, really definitive in telling what the, what people have been learning as, oh, there you go, let them out some steam, as, uh, as the journal that we have been keeping for many years now. I think since Hope was three, I started a journal and just, point form, writing down what we're doing every day. And it was very easy to notice if I started looking at it in subject form that I could easily pick out what we were doing in every day um, and just say, oh, that's that subject. Or, this is math because we were um, you know, cooking or this is math because we were figuring out you know, how much money we need to buy, how much hay um, and how much for a year it would cost. Lots and lots of examples. Um, so real life examples. Um, easy to find when I had this journal. So if there was ever any reason why I needed to maybe quantify this to people who aren't so familiar with unschooling, I have extreme uh, records of the kind of learning that we've been doing. And I can easily quantify it with the records I've got. So I think I like repeated myself, but sorry, bear with me. So that's why we're doing the journal because I actually said a few years ago, I was like, you know, I really just wish I had a journal that was just like for free schooling and you know, I've been kind of making other dollar store journals. Oh, pardon the plane. <laughs> I live next to an airport. You can't really see the plane taking off anymore. But we do live next to an airport. So, now and then it will interrupt. Oh, I think there's another one up there. Well, hopefully it doesn't interrupt me. Hopefully I can be loud enough that the planes won't interrupt too much, so. I wanted a free school, I wanted a journal that I could just use for what I was using it for instead of um, modifying other journals for the purpose. And I thought, I mean, if I'm the only, I, I can't be the only one that, that has this uh, idea of 
journaling this way, so I thought, what if a cool little illustrated journal that you could just easily remember, okay, I'm gonna write this this day, this day, this day, and it's not dated so that you don't have to worry about, well, if I didn't write it in one day, it's like glaringly obvious the dates that are missing. <laughs> so no, it's not gonna be dated. Just gonna be cute little illustrations. Um, and divided into sections so that it's really easy just to pick a section, say what you did that day in point form. And uh, you know, over a year, there's gonna be, I think, about 84 pages, so it should be enough to definitely do, maybe not 365 days, but I mean, you know, we don't, nobody records for that amount of time unless you're homeschooling anyway, so it's really unnecessary to worry about it that meticulously. If you want to, no problem, you can just keep going with another journal. So yeah, I, I'm really excited about the release of this journal. We sh we're plans, you know, fingers crossed. Mm -hmm. That's my fingers crossed. I don't know if you can tell um, that we have the that it really it's released uh, or published, ready to be published by this week um, coming. That's today's January the 20th, and we're hoping the week coming. So, but I'll keep updating on that and letting you know. Um, and yeah, so I'll probably. Uh, you know, flash a picture of the preschool and journal. You know, just take a picture there. You know, and then yeah, there'll be a preschool, preschool and journal picture, so you can like see the artwork maybe at the end of this little vlog here. That'd be kind of cool. So yeah, um, yeah, I'm gonna get going because I've been talking for a while and I have to get working. So I have things to do. Um, River is you know, ready for his barn to be clean. So I'm gonna get out of here. Thank you so much for listening to me ramble on. Um, that is so far our plans for 2018. I will keep updating you as we have more. And uh, thank you so much. Uh, so much, much love from the Free School and Homestead right from the barn. You have a great day. Delicious.